It's easy to find the truth these days. You put the kettle on, grab that good old cuppa, turn on the TV or get on your phone and just take it all in. That's it, really. Or is it? A wise man once said, when you hear the news, don't look at how it is presented to you or who it comes from. Because the world we live in today has become accustomed to hiding the truth behind curtains upon curtains of lies. Men and women are willing to sacrifice their honesty on the altars of self-interest. Our leaders dress evil in glorious garments and use it to fuel wars and oppression. But if you knew where to look, if you knew who to choose as your role model, it's not difficult to distinguish the truth from falsehood. The truth has been echoing through history for generations after generations, from the burning sands of Karbala, where the very symbol of integrity and honor stood against the very definition of evil and dishonesty. We learn from Hussein never to be afraid of standing up for honesty, for truth, for compassion, against injustice, lying and greed. Karbala taught us to live as free men and women, never to be satisfied with what we are forced to believe is right or wrong, to keep questioning, keep looking. Today, more than ever, we need to pursue the truth. The question is, do we have what it takes? like Hussein did.